boys let's talk about this latest ap update what did it do who did it help did it help me did it help you did it help timmy did it help john who knows i know it helped everybody that's using escape artist quarterbacks man and honestly kind of all should it's the best ability in the game it's the most op ability even talks of getting rid of it completely have been going across the world so I mean, if people were wanting to get rid of it, it's kind of OP. I mean, I know you guys play those guys that roll out every single play. You might have become one of them. You know, who knows? But I, I think it's the best. And it's made it a little more viable with this AP. What they did is increase offense and defense by two. Listen, it always gets you like, hmm, I want to try something new. I want to try this. I want to try that. But let me show you what you guys I'm going to do. But first, I want to tell you about the controller. I've been using my Elite Broke so I linked up with the people at Thrustmaster that brought me this great controller. They are the number one people in flight simulation and race car simulation. You know, all them cars, the big steering wheels, the clutches, the pedals that you guys see. They are one of the top manufacturers of that and the flight simulation as well. They said, let's make an Xbox controller. And they reached out to me and said, would you like to try it out? I did. I've been using it for about two weeks now. I love it. You can interchange all the parts here. You guys see you can change different colors, whatever it may be. It has buttons on the back that I'm, I don't really use for Madden, but I use them for all the shooting games I play. Everything else, they definitely help way better than paddles. So this controller has been a blessing for me. It's going good. Going into the MLB season and rest of the man, I'm excited to use this one, man. So check it out. That link is below. But let's talk about what I did on offense and defense. Now, defense, I want you guys to tell me what you're doing because I have no idea what works. I, I believe in two abilities on defense, acrobat and unpredictable. That, that's what I believe in. You know, So everybody on my field has acrobat. Everybody on my field has inside or, uh, unpredictable. Let's take a look at that first. That's my defense. You guys see Taylor Mays, Sean Taylor. I actually have secure tackler and mid zone on both my safeties and secure tackler on Sean Taylor. I feel like it's a Bobo enforcer. It's pretty good. I might throw it on everybody else. I have Sherman and Metcalf on the outside with Acrobat. I don't put it on my slots because I blitz them so much that it's kind of, I don't want to say it's like a waste if they're always blitzing, but I just send them so much that it's kind of, even if they're 50% of the time blitzing, I think it's kind of a waste to put Acrobat on them, but maybe I will. I don't, can't really find a, a defensive ability I like other than Acrobat and <laughs> Unpredictable. Uh, mid zone is cool. I don't think it's amazing, you know, but I have so much AP. Why not try it? I have Clowney. I love this card. We got unpredictable on him, unpredictable on Freeney, who's still a beast for me. But what I did with that extra two, just do it on Aaron Donald inside stuff. You see, Aaron Donald, we actually have inside stuff. And this ability, I'm kind of like, I can't lie, defensive rally. I kind of like this one. I'm kind of sold on this one. I mean, not like I am with the other two I talked about, but this one, I mean, we got so much AP to play with. Why not try it? Put it out there. It gives you more pass rush points. I don't know what that means. I think it's like more juice when you're pass rushing on third and fourth down. That's when you need to get off the field. And we put inside stuff. I'm tired of people running. I just want to stop it for free. Maybe that'll work. But you guys know if you're on offense, if you just double team the inside stuff, he won't ever shed. So kind of a wasted ability against good people. But that's a pro tip for you. Hit the like button if you want more pro tips. Offense, this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm starting out tonight. Weekend league. Escape artist and pass lead elite. Now, I know McNair, as you guys know, we're giving away. McNair has Gunslinger and Pass and uh, Escape Artist. I honestly like Pass Lead Elite better. I, I'll try to explain it throughout videos, but I like it better. We're going to put deep out on Randy Moss. He's going to catch any crossing route. He's going to catch any corner route. He's going to catch any deep streak, deep post, anything over about 15 yards. He's going to catch automatically. And then we have Route Tech on our boy Josh Gordon, who I think is the most underrated player in the game. Now, Route Tech, people say they don't like it. I love it. If you run man coverage, you see Josh Gordon with that 98 deep route running the 99 speed. If you run man coverage, he will be a touchdown every single time on the post. Force your opponent to put some deep blues out there. That will just lessen the amount of people they have out there to try to stop escape artists, man. But I'm throwing around a bunch of different ideas, man. But this is what I'm going to start with. This is what I'm going to put out there with 18 AP on offense on weekend league this weekend, man. I might. I even thought about going escape, pass lead elite, and roaming. So I make sure I throw the ball on time every single time. Make sure I always get a perfect pass when I'm running. That's that's a big deal. But this is what I'm going with. Let me know what you're going with, especially on defense, man. I have like 7, 8 AP on defense. I don't even know what to do. But this is what I'm starting with. And if you guys are in the chat, you guys are on YouTube, abilities, abilities, this is what I'm rocking for this weekend league.